Good day. Today we will talk about independent samples theory test. Uh, in this uh, test, we will compare between two means of two independent groups. For example, let's say uh, an instructor want to compare his uh, uh, test for two classes uh, if the performance of the classes is equal or there is a difference between them. The null hypothesis, we assume uh, the, the mean of the class A equal to class B or there is no difference uh, between the two classes. The alternative will be, no, there is uh, a difference. And since there is a sign of uh, unequal, we assume uh, this will be two tails a tail. Also, uh, we, uh, they give us uh, the alpha is 0 0.05 or 5%. Uh, and since it's two tails, it will divide it to two, uh, 2.5 to the percent to the right and 2.5% to the left, or exactly 0 0.025. The degree of freedom, since this one is a 25 uh, students or respondents, the degree of freedom is 24, and the degree of freedom of the class B is 19, 20. The total uh, degree of freedom of this test will be 24 plus uh, 19 will be 40. Uh, the first step, um, I want to calculate uh, what is the the critical value. I can uh, find that one in uh, some tables uh, for the p-test, but uh, I can uh, do it uh, directly uh, by using Excel. Uh, this is uh, the command uh, t imv.2t and I will put the probability and the degree of freedom. Uh, let's do it. Uh, it equals to t uh, two tails this one okay and then the, this one point zero five comma and forty three enter he will give me uh, two point zero one six seven okay meaning two point uh, zero one two seven here to the right and negative Left. Uh, meaning, uh, if I calculate my t test and uh, my t test, uh, uh, the value of t test or score within the red uh, zone, meaning I need to reject the null hypothesis. Else, if it is within the this white zone, uh, I will not reject the null. Now. To calculate t-test, I need to have the mean of both classes and the standard deviation for both classes, so I can calculate t-test. First here, I will calculate the, the average of uh, this, the, uh, this uh, class A, uh, some, very simple, it's only say equals to average, okay, the average then I will select my data, enter, give me a default. This is, I will, the same, I will do it with the class B. For standard deviation, I will use a standard deviation, for example, okay, uh, it will be like this, equals to STDV standard, and then I will select my data from here to here and enter okay and then i will do the same with the class b now i have the the mean and the standard deviation to calculate t i need to have sp which is the full sample uh, full sample standard deviation okay uh, this i will calculate this one first before i will put the t N1 or uh, for class A is a 25, N2 is a 20. The standard deviation is taken from here. 
and the other standard deviation uh, take it from now to calculate the uh, for example the variance here which is without the square root okay uh, you can see here it's uh, n one minus one times uh, this value of the standard deviation square plus uh, n two minus one times the standard deviation of the sample two uh, plus b uh, squared all divided by n1 n2 minus uh, minus 2 will be possible uh, don't forget uh, if you make any mistake with this parenthesis possible you will have here now we will have uh, the value here is 36.74 to calculate FP, we will get the square root of this value. Okay, one equal to square root. Okay, square root of uh, of this value. It will give us six point zero six. To calculate the T test, we will follow this uh, formula, which is the mean of the first class minus the mean of the second class divided by the SPN. Now you can see here uh, this is the, the first mean minus the second mean divided by SP. This is the SP here uh, times the square root 1 over N1 plus 1 over N2. And then after that, I will get uh, 0.44. Now, to calculate the probability of this one, uh, we will use uh, the t-test uh, command. Okay, equals to t-test command, this one here. He's asking me what is the first array. This is my first array or sample. And then he, comma, is asking what is the second one. This is the second one. Okay, comma. He's asking if it's one tail or two tails. It's two tails. I will click on this one and he asked me uh, what type. Uh, the type here is uh, two sample equal a uh, different. Independent and close. And the uh, probability is 0.65. Uh, now, let's uh, find the conclusion. This is the zero here, somewhere here. This is the zero. Our T, I found it here, equals to 0.445. Okay, 0.445 somewhere here. Okay meaning i will not reject the null hypothesis okay result do not reject the null hypothesis conclusion there was no significant difference between the test performance of class a and class b you notice here uh, take me long time to calculate all uh, these things i hope there is no mistakes happen also I can do that one in one step. Actually, I can do it uh, very fast in, in one step, uh, all this uh, calculation by uh, using a data analysis package. This is the data analysis package. Okay, but before uh, we will go to that, I want to remind you if uh, you don't have data analysis package, you need to go because that's not by default go to air files options and then you go to add in and then you go to excel here and then you check the analysis tool pack okay i have it already i don't need to do it okay i will select from here is uh, two sample uh, uh, 
equal this one okay equal and then okay and he's asking me uh what is, where is the range i am telling him the range here you see i put include the label okay the second one this one including the label and then i check the first row is a label and where you want uh, your output i am telling him i want my output let's say uh, here and okay you see i uh, he calculate for me all this data what i need the mean the mean is 84 and 83 which is the same here the standard deviation is uh, 5 and 6 here this is the square you if you get the square root of this uh, numbers you will have the same answer uh, 25 points that's n1 and n2 and this is full uh, uh, variance which is uh, here this one is the same answer here uh, you can see I, I have the same uh, answer here and the same uh, here okay and also the degree of freedom 43 this is 43 here and the t-test uh, this is the t-test uh, 0.4454 which is uh, similar uh, to the here i make the calculation and also he calculated for me the p for the two tails uh, he calculated for me is 0.658 0.658 and uh, finally the critical for the two tail uh this one which is similar to this one okay you can see here the conclusion uh, i can use this uh, package to calculate the two sample uh, t-test uh, with uh, very fast if you click okay then i will use all this thing here uh, finally, I hope uh, you learned something new in this uh, video uh, and have a nice day. Thank you for watching.